Hey guys, I want you to close your eyes. Yeah, seriously, close your eyes and think about MetaZoo. Who, whose face comes into mind? Is it Mike Waddell, whose only public appearances, from my knowledge, are in Alpha Investments videos, own videos? Is it Andy? I still have no idea what, what Andy looks like, his age, or any information about Andy. The CEO, or I guess the last CEO of MetaZoo. Is it any of these board members that supposedly exist? Nope, we don't even know what their names are. Is it Pancho, the artist, who got replaced by Alpha Investments Kid? Nope, uh, not Pancho. Is it Lily? Is it any of these people who, <laughs> who are vastly underpaid as artists? Nope. It, it's one guy. It's Alpha Investment. And you might be like, oh, that's not fair. Well, he's on every playmat, right? He's on... Have you played, Matt? Without him, MetaZoo is nothing. I mean, it's nothing. He's the biggest content creator who covered MetaZoo on YouTube. And he sold the most MetaZoo to his patrons. Uh, Pay Money Wubby actually told people not to buy MetaZoo as a financial investment. This guy, uh, Alpha Investment, would later say that it's not investable. But look at his name. Alpha Investments. Hmm. Hmm, what does he try and tell you about MetaZoo? Is it is a investment? All right, so we're gonna take a look at some new news. Uh, MetaZoo has hit an all-time low. Liquidity is dropping down. Uh, good for Argos. He got out before the announcement that MetaZoo was dead, uh, due to his cafe. In quotations, right? Good timing by Argos. Always. You know, in the beginning, right, it's almost as he, if he heard something and then kind of just sold when he heard instead of when Mike Waddell actually made the announcement. Uh, boxes are now selling for as low as $14 on eBay for two booster boxes. I kid you not, this product is basically firewood. I kid you not. I mean, I have never seen any game sell for $2 for a booster box. Um, no, okay, hold on. After fees, probably $5. I've never seen that happen. I mean, how does that happen? It's a MetaZoo Cryptid Nation 2nd Edition. There was a recent eBay sale. Two of them for a whopping... I know this is going to seem crazy. A whopping buy MetaZoo cards. I, I don't even see what the MetaZoo cards are. I think TCG player has deleted all the MetaZoo. Let me see. Okay, we're at MetaZoo now. The Cryptid Nation Kickstarter Edition booster box, the one that Alpha Investment so happily gave that, you know, dude who bought $8,200 is now less than $800. I'm looking at the eBay listing, right? Or I'm looking at a TCG player listing right now for $809.99 plus $2 shipping. This booster box and... and I mean, it used, it's from Open Boosters. Wow. On YouTube, Open Boosters coming in there and undercutting. But at the same time, you know, the last one that has sold was on February 1st, 2024. And that one sold for $900. Open Boosters be undercutting. Man, I got to screenshot this. Unbelievable. Open Boosters getting in on the action. So... Yikes, my, my dude. I'm screenshotting this for evidence later in case people say, wow, Open Boosters is under... And that guy's rich as hell, man. When he is moving, you know, he, he's got... A, you got Karami Cryptid Carnival booster box case, 12 boxes for $700 or less. Market price is less. You got Seance. You got uh, UFO. And you got Rudy Chan promos that no one wants anymore. Content creator metal. Okay, with like a rabbit. I don't know what that is, but it seems like it's kind of valuable. Uh, I think that's the promo that one dude kept selling on, on TCG Blair. He probably had all of them. Yeah, this booster box that Alpha Investment said was worth buying at $100 native first edition. It's less than $35 now on eBay. So, I mean, yikes, my dude. Um, yikes. Oh, I'm trying to find, uh, what am I trying to find? I'm trying to find 
booster boxes. Let me. There's so much shit in this product that it is ridiculous. Let me go to booster boxes. High to oh, I probably should go low to high if I want to find it. Um, let me see. Where is it? Uh, so UFO, Cryptid. I mean, none of these products are really that high. I mean, they're all basically firewood right now. But I'm trying to find that Cryptid. There's something wrong with that Cryptid Nation Second Edition. Probably it was a second edition printing. I cannot find it on TCG Player. Maybe it got removed because sales were so bad. That's Seance. That's Seance. That's UFO. That's Wilderness. Oh, here we go. Let me click on it right now. Uh, 36 packs, my dude. Okay, so there's a sale for less than $7 a box. And you have 36 packs. Let's say after fees, it's $5 a box. So the... If you are able to contact these individuals, you're talking about 13 cents a pack, 14 cents a pack for MetaZoo cards. Like if there's a way for you to contact these individuals and not pay eBay fee, wink, wink. Um, I'm sure these individuals have like a lot more MetaZoo cards at 14 cents a pack. I mean, that's cheaper than Meta X. It's cheaper than Inyo. That's the cheapest I've ever seen a card game go. From a sealed booster box. And we're not even talking about loose packs. We're talking about packs from a sealed booster box. 14 cents, right? From $82,000 to 14 cents. <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, I guess we have to use Apples to Apples Nightfall from $820 to... Eight dollars and twenty cents. I mean, it's just this is not it, guys. I, I cannot imagine anyone thinking this was investable. So I actually agree with Alpha Investments on this one. How could anyone think this was investable given the current prices? Like, guys, like it's not something does not collapse this fast. I, I guarantee you, Magic the Gathering were to die today, the prices wouldn't collapse like this. Not this fast. Everything is collapsing from the booster boxes to the sealed. And sealed should be fun to open. Are you telling me like this is such little value that for four, 14 cents can get you shit right now? Uh, we went to Wendy's the other day and we got like a small fry. It was like $2.80 for tax in, in Houston. And a small fry. Like my girlfriend just wanted, she's pregnant, so she just likes to eat random stuff. She was like, oh, I really want Wendy's uh, fries and nuggets. The money effing fries were two dollars and eighty cents for a small fry. Not a not, and there's actually a, a, a size smaller than that called Junior, and that's like, I think a dollar fifty nine with tax, probably like close to two dollars, and that's like the the thing that they give the little kids meals. Like for fourteen money effing cents. I mean, I mean, for for a Wendy's large fry, you could buy a booster box of medicine. I'm not kidding. Like for what two tacos. You can buy a booster box of MetaZoo. Like, like if you guys love this game, where are you? Like, I mean, this is an auction. These are auctions I'm showing. Like, aren't why aren't you not bidding on this? Like, can you just eat a few less tacos and just bid on this? Because I'm sure the people selling it would be very grateful to you. But my God, this is pretty... Um, I've never seen it before. I've never seen a game go down so low, so fast. And I have been around many dark dead car games.